What's up, Salmon Squad? I am the game Salmon, and welcome to 6 a.m. at the Chum Bucket. Another horror game made by Dave Microwaves Games and is one of the sequels to 3 a.m. at the Krusty Krab. And again, you know, it's all these, you know, 6 a.m., 3 a.m., 3.30 a.m. I think there's like a floater cemetery one, if I recall. You know, all of these were precursors to Around the Clock at Bikini Bottom. This game does mean a lot to me in kind of a weird way. It, like, this is the first game that I remember recording with the green screen. Like, I think this is one of the first things that, like, kicked off my new setup. And funny enough, I really don't remember much about it, so in a lot of ways, I'm going to be re-experiencing the game. So if you're excited for this video, like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all the things because you're awesome. Now let's go see what horrors are wait Squidward uh, that Plankton has set up or whatever. Whatever's in this game. Is there an evil SpongeBob in this game? I'm so sure there's an evil SpongeBob in this game. We'll find out. Endless mode. Was there an endless mode when I last played? Did I play endless mode? I don't know. Story mode. Let's do it. Come on, Squidward, deliver that pizza. The Krusty Krab pizza, you and me. Thank you for the controls. C to crouch. Love it. Let's go see what horrors await us with the chim. Hello? That's good voice acting. Who did the voice of Squidward? Or did you just, Dave, did you just rip Squidward's voice from like the show? That's fine too. All right, why am I here? What am I doing? Did I question that last time? I don't need to go here yet. Why am I here? Plan 749 will trick people into eating chum disguised as Krabby Patties. <laughs> what a horrible mastermind you are. Oh God. Oh, never mind. Plankton's dead. Wait, who is the problem now? All right, leave the chump bucket. Obviously, that's going to be super easy, and the game's just going to immediately end, right? <laughs> Sorry, I saw Chumbalaya. I'm like, wow, that's punny. All right, can I leave? Of course not. It's locked. Oh no! Get out of here. All right, kitchen time. Oh, is Karen behind all this? Find a way to turn off the alarm. You got it. Which means probably I gotta go to the laboratory or the maintenance, wherever that is. Or the door control. Ooh, that seems useful. Is something after me? Do I have to worry about something? Do I have to worry about Karen? Pretty sure Karen's around here. The door to the lab has been unlocked, perfect. Okay, good thing it's just right over here. That looks dangerous, I'm not gonna touch that. Oh, right, yes, this is my lab. Oh, and this is my laboratory. Oh God, Karen, Karen. Oh my God. So many Karens have been unleashed since I first played this game and uh, dealt with you, okay. Uh, okay, I can't go that way. Uh, uh, where do I need to go? Karen, can you guide me in the right direction? Please don't electrocute me with whatever you got in your hand here. Okay, where am I going, kitchen? Why do I need to go in here? Is there any reason for me to go into the kitchen? Oh god, key inside maybe? Okay, cool. Now I know where our key might be. Karen, 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 Karen. Oh my god, Karen. Karen, Karen, you're you're just don't be a Karen! Karen! God! Let me start that again. This time, maybe I will go and pick up the key inside the chum first. That sounds delicious. Mmm, scrumptious stuff over here. Gotta reach in that chumbalaya. Key inside, maybe. Okay, I found nothing. Well... Okay, what? Was Karen unleashed? Wait a minute. Anyone out here taking a poopy? Ah! Key inside the poopy toilet. That's cool. All right. I made sure to add a drainage to the sinks. You happy now, 8-Bit Ryan? Oh, did he complain about that? Oh, because there's a drain in this. I see. Okay. I see what's happening. That's why that sound bit keeps appearing. So Karen can spawn and just activate at different locations similar to how the, um, what you call it, the who, who's what's it, the, uh, the, the bash pinging masher can just randomly appear. Part of me has to just kind of get lucky. Are there checkpoints as I move along? God, I hope so. Let me find a key. Is this a key to the lab? Why am I searching for a key? I found a silver key. This is good. That's a burp. Okay, 
Door to the lab has been unlocked. I'm kind of afraid of going that way. Here's my lab, the laboratory now. Okay, I, yeah, I can't in this room. Oh, okay, so I need to find another thing to deactivate. Don't die. Okay, apparently we're good. Silver key for the maintenance. Oh, oh, oh my God, Karen. My God, okay, how do I, how do I deal with you? How do I lose you? Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't mean to go all the way to the restrooms accidentally. I'm gonna hide. You can't find me, Karen. <gasps> I lost you. All right, cool. Karen, don't appear. Hit some buttons. Heck yeah. Is this the door deactivation buttons? Are these the door deactivation buttons? Processing room door. I'm hoping yes. Here's a breaker. Power's already on. Oh, okay. That's probably for the second half of this game. That doesn't look good. Somebody spilled ketchup. Is there a reason for me being in here? Processing room. Maybe yes. Oh, no! The citizens of Bikini Bottom have been used for chum. Who could have predicted this? Planked. Oh, God. You had to pull all the levers. Come on, Squidward. Just figure it out. The door to the laboratory has been unlocked. Okay. Laboratory, here we go. Oh my god. I remember that there was an evil SpongeBob. Kind of, it was an evil robot SpongeBob. Um, use the contraption. Yes! I'm gonna press the buttons, and I'm going to leave immediately because that SpongeBob is gonna come alive, and things are gonna be terrible. Time to go. Front door unlocked. Time to go. Gotta turn on the lights now. Find the power box. Oh no. It's back here in maintenance, right? So I need stuff. Oh no! I can just turn on the power? What's the point of the storage then? Because there's a whole storage place back there. Okay, maybe I don't need to worry about that. Activate breaker one and two. Find the last one. Okay. Okay. Oh, one of two. Excuse me. So, so there are two total. I heard a squish sound. That sounded delicious. Here's the breaker. Oh, wow, that's easy. Dave has come a long way in making games. Like, this is a four, four-year-old game. Yeah, uh, just about. Now, power's restored. Now I get to the front and I can leave. And everything's gonna be hunky-dory and amazing and nothing horrible. You're in the vents, aren't you? Okay, hold on. We need to find the kitchen exit. Is it over here? <gasps> yes, it is, Squidward. Why, what was Squidward doing here in the first place? No, oh, no, Karen! Squidward has been turned into some delicious calamari. Is the game still going? It, it, I thought this was the end. Maybe it's still the end. And I'm just gonna die. No, find a way out? We're gonna turn you into chum, Squidward. Okay, cool. I don't know why you didn't just do it and didn't like restrain me. <laughs> god! Oh my god, it's a chum monster. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, look at him go. Look at him jiggle. Okay, so this is a whole thing. Yeah, I'm guessing that was a chum monster dancing kind of sexy on his way to get me. I don't know what's up. Look at him jiggle! Look at that jiggle! Tell me he doesn't want some of this! Oh my god. Sorry, I need to find a way out. My bad. I'm gonna focus up. Shut up. I see. I gotta start ducking in places and hoping that I find the right direction to go. This shouldn't be too bad. I love the jazz in the background. Are you kidding me? Heck yeah! Exit! I wanted to listen to the jazz a little bit more. I did what I need. Oh, God. Yeah. Can I can I go, please? Am I not allowed? Maybe I gotta go this way. So dramatic. Oh, I know where I am. Okay, I see. Ooh. Keep going! Go, Squidward! Go, Squidward! Go as if your life depends on it, cause it does! Oh god, oh, Spongebob, you butt coming from the ceiling. Don't tase me, bro! Oh, 
avoid the electricity, avoid the puddle, that's what I'm talking about. I need to go this way, everything's fine, and I'm alive. Until someone gets me. I escaped. Oh good, the police. You escaped, hooray! What was Squidward doing in there in the first place? Why? There was no reason other than like maybe Plankton ordered a delicious Krusty Krab pizza, which is a staple at the Krusty Krab restaurant. Okay, there is an endless mode, and if I've learned anything from the endless mode from 3 a.m. of the Krusty Krab, this might have some wild and wacky times. So let me see, I don't know, let me see what's different. Find a way to turn off the alarm. The Living Dead. Okay, are there chum zombies? Hello? Excuse me? Excuse me? Plankton. 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 Plankton, you kind of grew up a little bit on me, didn't you? You're kind of bigger than you're supposed to be. Sure. Okay. Let's not worry about you, and let's go f uh, find a key and deactivate the alarm. You totally didn't see me go into the kitchen. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. Plankton! Plankton! Let me get that thumbnail! Let me get that thumbnail! I wanted to get that thumbnail. Detonation irritation. Oh! Time before the whole place explodes! Oh! Oh my god! Okay, well that's not fair, Karen. Karen? All right. The Living Dead. Okay. Back to the whole Plankton thing. I should be able to beat this with Plankton. It doesn't seem like Karen is active with Plankton active, so... Works for me. Plankton totally didn't see me. Oh my god, Plankton is active. I mean, Karen is active. They're both active. This is not good for my health. So this is hard mode. Because there's more things after me. Is that a bone sticking out of Plankton? Uh do Plankton have bones? Oh my god, okay. Oh god, oh god, oh god, you don't see me. You don't, you don't see me. Guys, why? Don't do that. Don't, 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 you don't see nothing. You didn't see me go back here, I'm crouching, you don't see me. It was worth a shot, I had, I had to try. Destination, irritation, maybe it's only these two random events. Maybe that's it. Got a silver key. Karen didn't see me. Perfect. I don't think I need to play through the whole game in endless mode. I think it's gonna be nice to me. See, I- Oh! Oh god! Oh my god! It's the chum beast! Are we good? Oh, it's just exit and then we're good to go. Okay. And then it just starts over the next day. The next day. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, all right. So that's all endless mode is. It's just, it's literally just that first section. Um, which, are you not gonna give me a, uh, random event? Well, I beat one round of endless mode and really that's good enough for me. All right, Karen, let's go ahead and end this, right? We gotta end on a Karen jump scare. I mean, it's 2022. Karens have run rampant. Or Spongebob can get me, that's fine. Recently when I was looking through old videos trying to figure out what games I wanted to play to revisit, uh, to re-explore, to re-show off to the world, um, I found that my old 6am at the Chum Bucket video reached half a million views, which floored me. I had no idea that that video reached that many views and, you know, sometimes things like that really surprise me. When I started out YouTube, I had no idea that I would eventually make it to where I am now. Uh, that's a burp, I'm sorry. I have well over 2,000 videos on my channel, and really when it comes to analytics, I'm often only looking at the recent ones, trying to figure out what I'm gonna play next, what people like right now, um, but I often lose track of how old videos do. Uh, there's just too many to keep track of and sometimes I'll look back at an old video and like the views did numbers I'm like when did this reach half a million views like that's nuts to me So I, I just wanted to let you know how thankful I am that you're watching this video I'm so thankful to have an audience 
that enjoys the videos that I create. Uh, Cause sometimes, you know, I'm just, I'm a dude sitting in an empty room, kind of an empty room, not really empty, but um, I'm alone making jokes, screaming, staring at a camera. Um, you know, but after I post the video, there's this whole world that happens. There's so many people that like my stuff and watch it. And I, I just been very grateful recently that I do have this audience on YouTube and I, I really want to um, do good with it. I hope I've done good with my YouTube channel so far and I hope to do more good uh, with it. And that being said, thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to click on the end card at the end of this video. Also be sure to like and subscribe if you have not already done so. I love you guys so much. Go out there and make someone's day. Be happy, stay happy. And I will see you guys later. Goodbye. No Karen, right? <laughs> well, that was a cringe jump scare reaction. Was that really me four years ago? My god.